What's going on everyone? Today I'm going to take you through a bit of a shopping day. So I go to Aldi and I go to Coles on like a weekly basis. Sort of get a bit of, get a few things from Aldi, a few things from Coles. Get most of my meats from Coles. Aldi's doesn't have quite the variety like Coles does, but Aldi's a lot cheaper for the other things, so it's good for that sort of stuff. So, um, first off, we got the oats. Oats, I, I have oats every morning and sometimes during the day for like a pre-workout meal or something like that. <coughs> and some lollies, you gotta have lollies on demand for that in the house, but lollies all like to snack on lollies sort of post-workout. It's always good to have simple sugars just to restore those glycogen levels. Brown rice, another important, another good source of carbs. Slow digesting carbs, so it's good for in the mornings or I have it sort of well, at least once a day I have brown rice. Then we've got some um, salmon and some eggs, good both good protein sources. Um, some fruit, I have fruit, I have at least two two pieces of fruit a day. So I, when the nectarines are in season I love them, the yellow nectarines. And um, always just go the pink lady apples and some bananas normally. So yeah, I like to snack on fruit, we've included in my, one or two of my meals per day. Bananas, I normally buy them sort of a little bit green, because that's going to last a bit longer. <coughs> what's the size of those things? Oh, you go, go the steak, go a rump steak, just because it's a bit cheaper and I, I don't actually mind the cut, I find it's a bit less fatty. It's another protein source, have that for dinner or something. Some veggies, so some fresh produce, some corn, some broccoli, I have that with my meals every day. Some sweet potato, I have that once again every day with my meals. So I have a sweet potato and chicken meal and broccoli and then I have another rice and chicken and broccoli meal. So I've been eating that for like the last three years, every twice a day. <laughs> so. It's not quite getting over it. I'm over the chicken, but the chicken breast is a bit dry, so as you'll see later on, I've started buying the, the roast chickens, which are a bit moister and a bit easier to do. You don't have to cook it yourself, so I've been doing that lately. Some onions, I just use that to make things taste a bit nicer, so I put it in the cooking. Some red onions, make that for different sort of salads and like stuff like that. Some carrots, some more veggies, so normally I have just sort of this sort of veggie meal stuff for the dinner, dinners, so I'd normally just steam them up with some sort of carrot, pumpkin, um, peas, that sort of thing, and sweet potato most of the time. Some um, green capsicum, have that in just in salads again, normally around the dinner time. My, my dinner always changes, but then my my during the day meals, breakfast, meal two and meal three throughout the day all stays the same, so it has done for a long time. Some avocados and essential, a good fat, a good natural healthy fat to have in the diet. Keeps you fuller for longer if you sort of incorporate these into your diet. Especially good if you're doing a low carb, sort of trying to lose some weight. Some healthy fats like the avocado would be great for that. Man, my neck is not feeling very good. Tomatoes. There's tomatoes in the salad again. Salad on it if I have a sandwich with wholemeal bread or something, I'll put it on that. Natural yogurt, I've been having the Greek style yogurt, but we're getting sort of over that, and so I'm gonna try this natural yogurt. Have that with um, some muesli, which is, quite nice, sort of just oats with like different dried fruits all up and together. Blue frozen blueberries, have that with my oats in the mornings, just put about put it on top of the oats. And um, just milk, light milk. So I pretty much only have that when I'm having coffee, it's about the only time I have milk. Now for that, just we've got two coals. So just getting some, some lettuce that I forgot to get from Aldi, just for salads again, that's normally around dinner time. Lamington's like, can't pass it up a dollar for the six Lamington, so I was like, might as well. Here's the hot chooks I was talking about, so already done, cooked for you, it's way easier, it's pretty nice and moist, so I've been doing that lately instead of the chicken breast. 
chicken breast just got too dry. But now I've got my Barbie, like you saw. I might be able to cook some nice, moist chicken breast. And some super dupers, it's getting hot, so I just thought, why not get some super dupers? Have one or two a day, there's nothing wrong with that. A bit of sugar, but it's fine. So unfortunately my camera died after that. But all I got was just um, some sweet potato fries and some lean like beef mints. So normally I do that in like either a spag bowl or just sort of plain sort of mince with some onion and whatnot. So a few things I didn't get in the video, but I do have just in the cupboard at home. So I've always got some wholemeal pasta. I just want to make some sort of pasta. Sultanas, another good, another good um, simple sugar sauce. And there's, there's a few other things, but that's like the base of what I eat, like on a daily basis. A few like extra things, but that's pretty much it. So I hope this, um, hope you all, enjoy, all enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you in the next one.